Hello Internet! Welcome, it's Wednesday and it's cold but it's not so cold. But I'm moving quickly to keep warm. Anyway, today we're covering from the rain and getting ready for an entire round of wicked karaoke. I'll try and relate as much of my experience on that as possible, but going back to the topic. Fishing out more books, not necessarily recommendations. I haven't read all of them yet, but the ones I have read, I'll certainly recommend. Give it a try, they're books! Alright, let's start with stuff that friends have lent me because I have to return them soon. Beginning with the Mouse Guard, free comic book day 2012 hardcover. This is the most amazing free comic book day handout I have ever seen. I want to get a copy of this because, as you may know, I'm a giant Mouse Guard fan and this is an Archaea Press hardcover. So, yes. Also, has anyone read or heard about Barona's War? Because it's really starting to interest me and I want to know whether or not I should get it. The art style looks really quirky. I'm not sure about the story. If you've ever read Barona's War, please let me know what you think. I am really tempted to grab it. Another book another friend has lent me in order for me to read, which is now sitting fairly high up on the book pile, Okay, I don't think this needs any introduction. Although there's an interesting story about how I actually got lent this. Um, I turned up to a Game of Things night wearing the Pizza John shirt. On to stuff I've read. Like Tea World. Apparently the world's only t-shirt journal. If you're a big fan of t-shirts and especially the images on t-shirts and I am one because I certainly want to replace my entire wardrobe full of blank t-shirts with ones that have messages. Not, not this. This is a house shirt. Giveaway. I think it's a fellow thing where relatives give you um, a shirt with the name of the place you just went to. Still Seattle, love you. Mwah, mwah. By the way, this is the only magazine I have in my collection that comes in hardcover. So, mwah. yes! Next book. I finished reading this. Squirrel Seeks Chipmunk by David Sedaris. These are like Aesop's fables for people with a very, very dark sense of humor. Seriously, stuff like this, never read these to your kids. Pro tip, if you've ever bought the book, go to f*** to sleep. The book already says don't read it to your kids, so stop complaining about it. Also, there is a far more tame and boring kids version. Don't buy it. Books I haven't read. These things are sitting in a book pile, which is... Again, I've got a PJ O'Rourke book, good old satirist that he is. This book is called Don't Vote, It Just Encourages the Bastards. Which is a strange selection for a book for a guy who lives in Australia because I have no choice. I have to vote. But it deals with American politics. And honestly, America, your politics is a lot more interesting than ours. So I'm just going to take a nice seat and watch. Also, if you're asking me whether or not I would vote for Mitt Romney or Barack Obama in the upcoming elections, <laughs> it's your election, America. I can't decide for you. Obama. And the final book for my little Wednesday show and tell is Half Empty by David Rakoff. Man, I listen to too much American public radio. Um, all, all the recommendations are piling up now. As a natural melancholic, I think this book is going to do me a heap of good. Yep, I think I'm gonna like this one. I've always been one who distinguished between joy and happiness. I'll probably give an entire video to that subject personal call. But anyway, those are recent acquisitions. I hope you found something that interests you enough to grab it off a bookshelf or bookstore or wherever you want to grab it from. For those watching at home, I've attached links to each of those books down over there in the description. If you've read any of those books and you have a recommendation for more books I should get for my book pile, by all means, please comment. Again, internets, thank you very much for watching. You shall see me on Friday. See ya! Wonka Exceptionals? There's a brand called Wonka Exceptionals? Yummy.